Hey guys, your buddy Ace here from TheImpulsiveBuy.com and I got Guitar Hero on tour for the Nintendo DS. Uh, when you're tired of playing air guitar in public, now you can play it on the DS, which is only slightly less stupid. Alright, uh, I open up the box, very nice. Too bad it's 50 bucks, but you know, whatever, what can you do? You're paying extra for this plastic thingamajig, I guess. Here. Uh, comes with the manual, blah blah blah. Alright, let's get to the good stuff. In the box, you will receive the fretboard, which you will attach to the bottom of your Nintendo DS, uh, the video game, and an adapter if you still have the old DS, uh, and you're too poor to get a new one. I suggest getting a new one, uh, lest you be ridiculed in public. Here's the game, let's try it out, guys. All right. As you guys can see, I've attached the fretboard to the bottom of my DS, which my fingers will be playing. And then here's the guitar pick they give you uh, to strum at the screen uh, instead of flicking the button on your guitar controller. So in this version, it's a little different control-wise, but pretty much plays the same as you're going to be able to see here. I'm pretty crappy at this game right now, but you know, hopefully I'll get better. The difference in this version is instead of uh, moving your guitar to activate the star power, you're gonna have to like yell something into your mic, or you just breathe into it if you don't want to look like a douchebag. Uh, most of the songs were recorded by the original artist, so you won't get these crappy covers most of the time. As you can see, uh, my stupid screen set off the star power, but you don't have to do that, as I previously mentioned. So that's Guitar Hero DS, as you see I'm strumming the things here, and on the screen. And that's how that game works, so if you're interested, go ahead and pick this up, it's 50 bucks. Uh, read the rest of my review for specifics. Alright guys, see you later.